What speed are you rotating around the north and south poles of Earth? All right, let's go over a few definitions. First, we have the equator, which is a line drawn equal distance from the poles around Earth. Uh, then we have the circumferences, which uh, we have the west to east, or latitude circumference, which is uh, 24,901 miles. Then we have the north to south, which is, is the longitude circumference, and that's 24,860 miles. Uh, if you notice, the west to east is slightly larger. That is due to rotational momentum. All right, well, the first thing you want to do is uh, figure out where you are latitudinally. I'm about 40 degrees above the equator, so we will use that for the example. You want to figure out the diameter, which you can do that by doing uh, 24,901 over pi, which you end up equaling uh, 3,963. All right, now you're going to want to turn into a trick problem. Uh, all you do is just uh, put the hypotenuse as the radius, then you put in the 40 degrees. Uh, so you just take the cosine of 40 degrees times the radius, and for this one I got 3,035.8 miles. And that is the distance from your location to the pole or axis of the Earth. All right, now you're going to find uh, the circumference of the latitude line that you're on. You can do this by doing uh, 2 pi times the radius that you found the last step. Uh, I end up getting uh, 19,704 miles. So if you divide that by 24, you get how many miles per hour you're spinning around the Earth's axis. Thank you.